Hello and welcome back to our X4 Foundations Let's Play Poorly Unmodded. Uh, I have progressed ourselves just a little bit, essentially uh, just letting us fly up a little bit farther, uh, closer towards where we were planning to go. Uh, so we just have to get to this accelerator and then get into Silent Witness and then go into this accelerator here. Meanwhile, we've got Clamp Face just waiting here to pick up some stuff to, to do anything. He just hasn't really found anything to do just yet. But that's okay, we'll let him be. The Discoverer is still here in uh, Bright Promise, still scouting. Not doing so bad there. Drillbug is mining some Nividium. Drill Monk is full of silicon and is probably just about to do something to tell me. Oh no, they actually have—he actually has a place to sell that stuff. That's right. Um, okay. So we're gonna execute that trade and then head back and do some more mining, and then Man Monk is about to finish deploying the last of these resource probes and it looks like we've got helium, methane, ore, and silicon and since this guy is a regular mineral miner he'll just do some uh, ore and silicon mining here. It's not gonna be great, it's pretty low but yeah, that's fine. It's passive income, don't really care. Oh god, oh god, autopilic, autopilic! Thank you, thank you. God, you gotta keep your eye on that thing all the time. <laughs> And Callisto Chipmunk is about to do some trades here, refine, min mit refine metals, and then sell them to me, to sell them here, uh, so that we can get our, um, whatchamacallit, uh, our, our resources necessary for this uh, first storage module hack, so that we can hack for the blueprints for bigger storage, which we're going to need if we're going to do any kind of uh, mining depots and warehouses, which is my plan, uh, someone asked, uh, what is my end goal? What's my end game for this? What, what, am I, what am I sort of aiming for in this playthrough? And on the one hand, it's going to be fairly open-ended because it is the, the end game of this, of the end goal of this game is to just experience chill, right? <laughs> but... Uh, let me go ahead and turn off the... Because I am going right there. Let's uh, turn that off. Uh, but if I'm kind of aiming for a specific state, game state, it's going to be to kind of have warehouses and depots. I'd say, you know, like, you know, a third to 50% of the uh, uh, of the sectors have lo uh, fairly large depots that are fully stocked with um, supplies and then have... Um, trading ships and mining ships supplying and selling and so forth and just generally creating a dominant um, logistics uh, company essentially that's that's really sort of what I'm aiming for um, oop am I gonna make it yes okay here we go so we've never been in here before entering silent witness 12. All right, wow, this ain't ain't nothing out here. I mean, there are. We know they're out there. It's just that they're not within range. Yeah, not really in range of the scan. Something out here. Ooh, how, who found something? Let's collect that lockbox. Let's do that. Let's try this again. Wow. Wow. Yeah, everything's in everything in here is uh pretty hidden. Oh, but you know what that is? You know what that sucker is over there? That is a cock hive station. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna frickin' save my game right now. I forgot to do that before. We're gonna do that right now. Okay, I will be right back. Okay, here we are. So we know that there's a there's a cock hive up around here somewhere. There's always one up here. Uh, however, there's got to be there's a scale plate station around about here-ish somewhere down the down down the way. Of Pike. I uh, not 100 percent sure where, but it, it is it is over there somewhere. So 
So this long range scan, what I'm doing is I'm switching to long range scan mode, doing the scan and immediately bumping up into travel drive again. So it effectively keeps me in travel drive the whole time. Aha, there's a station. Like I slow down a smidge, but not a, not a crazy amount. So I could do that here. I long range, burst it, and then back to travel drive. All right, so who do we got here? There it is, there's the pirate base. But I don't see any ships around here. There we go, there's something. Ooh, it's a hive guard. That, well, that one's a hive guard. This guy up here, we, we don't know who that is yet. Do we want to go after him? What's he doing? He's he's going somewhere weird. Oh, uh, he's just kind of... Oh. Okay, he slowed down. Let's go get him. I mean, we're not going to be able to capture him. That's been the goal up to this point for this, you know, trying to get up here. But, you know. It's always good to... Oh, Jesus. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Gotcha. Alright, who we got over here? That's a Terran. Free Family, Zyarth. Free Family. Okay, so who, who am I against? Who do, who, who do I already... I'm a... Zyarth. Terran, definitely. Yaki, Xenon. Alright, so anybody anybody here I could go after. Um, I could try to take that... Oh, that that's... Mm, okay. This guy, this Zyarth guy, isn't Primer being... Gas. What was that? Talati. All right. He is not... being protected by anybody. But what are you? You're a wyvern. Are you big? Are you a biggin? Because you can't cap biggins without marines. I feel like you're just a... Oh, every time, every time I forget. I'm not talking to you. All right, that's fine. There we go, that's what I want. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. No! You stop that. I feel like it'll be fun. Let's see what we can do. Well, I'm not going to be able to catch him now. Ah, oh, the bastard. Yeah, he's going to outstrip me. Dang it. He knew I was coming after him because I scanned him and I shouldn't have done that. All right, let's head back to the base. Oh, Jesus. Oh, insufficient funds. Let's go back in here. There we go. Magpie. Argon Magpie? Okay, yeah, we can go after him. We're probably not going to cap him, though. He's too small. Oh, and he's too fast. I need a faster ship for this. Oh, he's going to die. Damn it. Ah, uh, I'm so bad at this. There's, there's the, there's the cock station. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get him.
My, only because his uh, the the um, my understanding is that the way that these are uh, the, these the bailouts are calculated is that the, uh, the 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 bigger the differential between your shield and hull level versus theirs determines whether or not they're likely to bail. My ship is being scanned. All right, let's orders. comply. If we're too if we're too big or they're too small, they won't bail because they're not terrified of us for being tiny and dangerous. Like, I, 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 I get why it's done that way for gameplay purposes. Um, because it essentially enhances the risk and enhances your um, the gameplay element. Although it is a little bit goofy that little ships being harassed by enormous ships don't immediately bail like wouldn't wouldn't you be like yep yeah, nope i'm out thanks but that is not that's not how it goes i am going to catch up to him but we'll see we'll see if we can get him probably not like i said and i'm only going a tiny bit faster than him so he, he might even make it he might make it to the accelerator before i do before I get there. We'll see. We'll see. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Just got to get him out of travel drive. Just got to hit him once. Just got to hit him once. There. There. Boom. Now I think I can talk to him. All right. Oh boy. Let's get this laser tower. He dumped his cargo, I think. Which, you know, I don't really want, but he doesn't know that. Get him to drop? No. Let me not go after him with the full force. There we go. Oh, come on. Just that. No. Yeah, I'm probably not going to get him. Ah, there we go. Surrender. Yay! Oh, I got him! Oh, I got him, I got him, I got him! Yes! Do I have a... I do, but if I do that, he's going to blow up in me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. If I send a Marine over, they tend to... I mean, I don't know what the what the, uh, what the the actual... Um, what am I doing? I don't know what the actual uh, in-game explanation is, but I suspect that basically it's the idea is like they've kind of booby-trapped the ship. And so if, if you get if you claim it with a marine, you it it will do damage. Magpie Sentinel. So we're gonna go and claim it ourselves. In order to do that, we need to find the we can't we can't get in. Right? Possible. Yeah. No one on board to grant, so I have to go and hack. I have to find the hack point to get in, and it's usually oh, that's because I'm on the other. I'm he's upside down. Oh man, why did I do that? All right, we're going this way. He's it's underneath, I think. Where is it? Oh no, that is the. T I don't know. I don't know how this thing is shaped. What the heck? Come on, where are you? Come 
Just gotta find it. Well, that wasn't upside down. Or is it? I don't know. I was asked to drop my No. Phone. No, orders. escape. It really can't be this hard. What the heck? Well, dang it. I'm not going to find it. I ain't got time for that. Eclipse Vanguard. Docking granted. We're going to send the Marine over. Hopefully it won't blow up the ship because I'm uh, it's in a bad state. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Oh, I'm not drunk, I swear. There we go. All right, let's uh, get back in the ship. Hello there. Get back in the cockpit here. There we go, and we're gonna go ahead Black and line. claim. Sentinel. All right, so that sends over my marine. How many marines do I actually have in here now? I'm. I've got none now. Okay. Don't blow it up. Don't blow it up. Don't blow it up. Get in there. You having the same problem I was? <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna leave you to it. Alright, we wait. Wow, we waited all the way, we made it all the way down here. Where is. Where? Where'd the ship go? There it is. Come on, get in there. Somebody glued the door shut. Is there anybody else around here we want to get? No. Oh. What? Did it not work? Oh, it did. It, did. it worked. Oh, but wow! Wow. Wow, look at that. That sucker is just about dead. Whoo wee. Okay. Let's uh let's get you let's let's get you to a doctor. Wow, okay. Uh let's put you let's see, uh let's go with the Argon equipment doc. Now I could just sell you. Let me see, how much would you sell for? Six, uh, half a mil, a little bit over half a mil, okay. Or we could upgrade you. Fix you up. Now, what are you? You're a little, um... You're just a little magpie sentinel. Do you... Uh, I mean, do I want to? Cost you a... Cost a mill to completely trick you out. We go to minimum. Okay, all right, here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go to minimum, we're gonna get the half a mil, and then half a mil just from, from going to minimum, because we're gonna get rid of a whole bunch of these things that we don't want. And then we'll see how it, how much it costs to sell it. It might be worth it to do that. But we just made half a mil, and we st we still, in fact, get the ship, right? So that is um, that is that is pretty handy. But now I need to go get another Marine. So let's go, how am I with Vigor? I'm good with Vigor, right? I'm okay with Vigor. Oh, but these guys need more money. God, you guys, why do you keep needing money all this time? Still waiting on those resources, but we're getting the refined metals. Okay, so we're gonna go to the Vigor shipyard here, or the, the wharf, and get some more Marines. 
or one marine, so that I can go and do some more claiming. Because that's fun. That was the first time I, was, I succeeded at that in a little bit. Um, usually I'm too impatient, and I was like, ah, fuck it, and I just shoot him to death. Um, don't want to keep doing that. But, you know, we, we, we got ourselves a little ship. It's, it's not the best ship, but we got ourselves a ship, and we're going to call this one... We're going to rename this to um, Cap, Magpie Sentinel, just so that I know that it's a captured ship, so I can keep track of what I'm doing with it, so I don't look at it next time and be like, why do I have this? What is this for? Yeah. But what are you? Yeah, you're a little uh, courier ship. You've got 3,000 container storage. You're not useful for anything. Maybe I'll just use you as an explorer. <gasps> oh, you know what I'm going to do? Oh, I could use him up here. Use him up here and, and collect drops. Yes, that's what he'll be. That's what he's going to do for me. Oh, God, insufficient funds again. What is wrong with you? That what, what is going on with that anyway? All right, you're fine. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're all right. We're all right. Okay, so we're just gonna we're gonna chill while we wait for that. Oh, I'm gonna hit that thing, aren't I? Autopilot is gonna autopilot. It's gonna stop. It's gonna go around. Like, why can't you just uh, what? I, I don't have the nitpicky well I, it's unfair to call it nitpicky but I don't I don't generally react to AI glitches and, and insufficiencies in this game the way that a lot of other players do and I and it's partly because I don't play efficiently I don't play optim, uh, to optimize and as a result probably don't even notice half of the things that everybody else notices so I don't care but the one thing that bugs me is that they couldn't figure out how to navigate their autopilot through an asteroid field when your destination is not the asteroid field. I feel like all they would need to do is you come out of the accelerator, you go up out of the minefield, come down, and then go down out of the minefield, or asteroid field, not minefield, down, and then go to the accelerator. And while it is not the most direct route, it is by definition going to be faster because none of this crap is happening. Right? I feel like that that should have been the way they, they solved that problem. But they didn't. So, whatever. It usually just means that I can't rely on the autopilot to go through heavily asteroid uh, asteroided sectors. But that's fine. Yeah, we're waiting on these to come in. Why does that money keep going? I don't understand what's happening. Why does this why does this keep dropping and then nothing happens? Nothing changes. Okay, well that's fine. Man monk, what do we got? What do we got here, man monk? Man monk. Silent witness. One. We were gonna do what? We were gonna do silicon, weren't we? Yeah, I think so. Alright. Ooh, you can't do that, can you? Cause you don't have enough stars. Can I help? And I can't give you any stars. So, what we'll do instead is we'll do it by hand. Cause you know what? That's fine. That's fine. We'll mine some silicon over there and see what that gets us, how long it takes. And if it's decent, we might actually do, once we can get uh, another, uh, pilot summoner would give him repeat orders because he can't do repeat orders yet either he needs to be at least one star how's this guy doing oh let's turn off that okay he's almost there how am I doing am I almost there hey almost there ish everybody else seems to be doing okay You're still sitting here waiting for stuff. Okay, so what we're going to do then is we're going to go ahead and set, buy some antimatter. And then we're going to sell it. Oh. Never mind. Never mind. Wow. Holy cow. Ain't nobody buying antimatter, that's why. Nobody that I can see anyway. 
I need to start putting some uh, satellites down. That's what I gotta do. How's my discovery guy? Oh, he's moved on. He's gone to memory of profit now. Where is he going? Oh, he's just decided to go. Oh, I put him in Black Hole Sun. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <sighs> okay, so maybe we'll use the magpie instead of doing the collecting the drops. We'll have the magpie drop satellites. Do some drop sat action. Oh, come on! All right. Uh, autopilot, you're just going to have to come back later. Finishing up the episode here. System. Just got a few more minutes. Oh, there's some stations we haven't seen yet over here. It's all right. I definitely want to put some satellites, some big ones here, because this is uh, this is a good cluster. Oh, which reminds me now. Okay, so the cap ship is gonna have to get the captured magpie. We're gonna rename you. We're gonna call you Mag of All Trades. Oh, 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 oh. Docking granted. In we go. All right, there was the. That's the half mil that we got from the. Uh, Successfully yeah, docked. From the. Well, uh, cha equipment well change. Jump. Thank you. All right, uh, let's upgrade. We just need to give ourselves two marines. How's that sound? I think that sounds great. Oh, but you know what? Do we want to do anything else right now? Okay. Well, this one's still changing equipment. So okay, let's uh, let's see. Is there anything we need better here? Oh, there's nothing we can do really here. Got the beam emitter, which we I freaking love the beam emitter. And then this one is the ion blaster. Okay. We're maxed out here on all of these. We don't need these missiles. We've got a couple of set. Let's bring ourselves back up to five, five, and five. Give ourselves another flare. We don't really use those too much. And we've got Max. We got our best. Oh, here we go. I want to give myself my best combat ones, I think. Yeah, that'll reduce my yaw, but increases my strafe, my roll, pitch, all that jazz. Yeah, all right. And it's only going to be 114 total. And that'll take 30 seconds. Okay, now, Mag of All Trades, you are done. So let's go ahead and give you. Let's give you. Five of those, woof, and give you ten of those, and then give you some crew. There. You're not going to be super fast, but you're going to get the job done. All right, Mag of All Trades. First up, you're going to go ahead and drop, drop sat right here. Drop sat. And then uh, drop sat right here. How's that? And then come on down here. We've got some satellites over here. So you know what? I'm going to drop advanced sat right here and then collect these two. And then I'm going to drop and advanced over here and then collect these two all right and we'll sit there for now we'll do more uh once we once once we've got the lay of the land to get no you know what hey let's just do this one because that one's right there and we know exactly what we need to put there 
Okay, we're good. Drill Monk is no has no buyers because we got full silicon now. And let's see. That's not what I want. I want this. And I want that. Who's buying silicon? Let's go sell you some silicon. There we go. How's Clamp Face? Clamp Face is still kind of just like... Right? Clamp Face. Yeah, no trades found. Yeah, we'll just wait it out a little bit longer. But I think that's going to be it for the episode. We are at 30 minutes. So, yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time.